Jackie with Jackie G Designs and today I have some really fun cards I wanted to share with you. All of the cards were created using the new Doodlebug So Punny line. So let's go ahead and get started. The very first card I wanted to share with you, I used this adorable little pink typewriter with the You're Just My Type sentiment. I thought those were super duper cute. I did go ahead and cut half inch strips to create my background piece, matted it on white cardstock, and my base is actually a black cardstock. I love black backgrounds. I did go ahead and use my Fiskars punch for my border, and then my Spellbinder circle die to create this little background for my typewriter. To finish it off, I went ahead and used some May Arts ribbon. So here is the first card. For my second card, it is actually a gatefold card. It has been forever since I've created a gatefold, so I thought it was definitely time to give it a try again. There is a lot of dimension in this card, so it's probably going to cost me a little bit extra to put it in the mail, but that's okay. Again, you guys, I love to scrap chunky, so it's all right if I have to pay a little bit extra postage. So for this card, I did not have enough of the paper to create the circle. I did go ahead and use, um, again, my Spellbinders circle nesting dies. So I went ahead and used the front of the paper collection, the chipboard piece that shows you all the papers that are in the collection. So I don't know if you look really closely, I did go ahead and hide um, the company's name. So Doodlebug was actually right here. So I just hid those with these cute little thread ephemera pieces. So here is my second card. For my third card, I did go ahead and emboss the background with these cute little dots. I am so sorry, I cannot remember the embossing folder that I used for this card, but any circle dots would definitely work out. I did use my Fiskars border punch for this one as well. I did curl up the ends so it gave it this three dimension. Again, lots of lots of a dimension in this card. And one thing that I absolutely love about this collection is the sayings are so adorable. They're super cute and funny that they will work for any occasion. I know that majority of this paper is for Valentine's Day, but I really don't think that it has to be restricted just to Valentine's Day. So for this card, I actually will send that out as a thank you. I thought the sentiment, you're the you're a cut above the rest is super duper cute and definitely perfect for a thank you card. You could also make any of these cards happy birthday or thinking of you. So you're not limited just to Valentine's Day for this collection. So here is the last card I wanted to share with you. I absolutely love this card. It's got the adorable little cacti on it, which is super fun because we live in Arizona. So again, that's of course why I love this card. The background is created with just three pieces of patterned paper. I did finish it off with my Fiskars border punch. Can you tell I love this border punch, you guys? Popped up, gave it a lot of dimension, and. It ended up being super duper easy, you guys. This was a very easy card to create. So here again are all the four cards that I created and I wanted to share with you. I hope that you enjoyed this. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch my video. Until next time, bye.